Hello everyone, I'm Dion from Dion Video Productions. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to add and set default titles in Final Cut Pro. Let's get started. Alright, so first I'm going to be showing you a more efficient way of adding titles to your project in Final Cut through keyboard shortcuts. And secondly, I'm going to be showing you how to change the default titles that will then be applied when using those keyboard shortcuts. All right, so first of all, if we look at my timeline here, as you can see, I have a few example clips from a recent fashion film that I shot that we'll be using today and to which I'll be adding titles. Now, typically when you want to add a title in Final Cut, you're gonna to want to open up the titles menu, scroll through the list, find one, and then click and drag this into your timeline overlaying the clip. Now this of course works fine, however there are several steps involved and is by no means the most efficient way to do this. The most efficient way to add titles in Final Cut is through using the keyboard shortcuts. So I'm just going to go ahead and close the titles menu here and we're going to go back to this clip and let's say over here we want to add a nice title in the middle of the frame. Now to do this we're going to press Ctrl T. As you can see, a basic title has now been overlaid on the clip just like that with one single keyboard shortcut. And you'll also see that the start of the title was marked right where I had the player head marker positioned before pressing the keyboard shortcut. Now in this case, the title is a little bit long, so I'm going to go ahead and click and drag from the right to make this shorter. There we go. And that's it. This is how we add a basic title just like that with one keyboard shortcut, Control T. Now over here on the right I have a second clip and I think this is a good opportunity to add a lower thirds title. Now a lower thirds title is used to for example supplement the information that is already on screen. So this is a great way to for example show a location, a occupation, a name, date or time, something like this. So a keyboard shortcut for this similar to the first, in this case we're going to be pressing Control Shift T. As you can see, just like before, a title has now been added. Of course, in this case, a lower thirds title positioned in, well, the lower left third of the frame. Now again, just like before, this one is a little bit long, so I'm going to go ahead and shorten this here from the right. And as you can see, we've now added two titles to our project with two very simple keyboard shortcuts. If we take a closer look at the specific titles that have been added, you'll see that both of them are the basic variant of the fonts. So we have the basic title here on the left, and then we have the basic lower third over here on the right. Now let's say we want to change this, as basic is the default setting that Final Cut will have. But let's say we want to change the default setting. So to do this, we're going to open up the titles menu, and then we're going to find our preferred title. Now, of course, you may have presets, you may have uh, plugins, or you may have some that you have separately installed or made. However, I always like to go back to the custom title, as this is a great place to start that will allow you to then easily change the font, color, size, and give you all the flexibility that you need in Inspector later once adding it. So let's say I want to make this the new default. Well, how do I do this? Well, to do this, we're simply going to right click and click on the first option, make default title. Now we're going to go ahead and find a different default for the lower thirds as well. So if we look at the list here in the titles menu, you'll see a subsection for lower thirds. And let's go ahead and choose one that we like. Let's say we want this one here. We're going to go ahead and select it once, right click, and this time we're going to click make default lower third. We can now close the titles menu and let's remove the previous titles that were added. And let's go ahead and test and make sure that our new defaults have been saved. So just like before, for a center screen title, we're going to press Ctrl T. There we go. As you can see, the title has now been added. And if we look at the name of the element, you'll see this is custom, indicating that this is the custom title preset. So I'm going to go ahead and shorten this a little bit, just like before. And then in the second clip, let's go ahead and add our new lower thirds title, Ctrl Shift T. And there we go. As you can see, we now have the new lower thirds title, in this case showing the date and time. And that's pretty much it. This is how to more quickly add titles through keyboard shortcuts and then change the defaults that are added. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. If it helped you out, be sure to leave a like down below and comment if you have any questions. For more content like this, I highly recommend checking out my full Final Cut Pro playlist. Thank you for watching.